How's it going everyone? So it's currently the 6th anniversary for Dragon Ball Legends and obviously that brings with new, you know, new characters, uh, new events, new missions, all that sort of stuff. So I thought in today's video I'll show you how to get all the medals for the 6th anniversary, right? Because obviously we do have a special medals, uh, which I'll quickly pull up here in the missions. Uh, you do get, I think it's 4,000 CC all up? Yeah, 4,000, right? So these medals I'll be showing you how to get is for all these, right? So obviously you need them for your Dragon Balls as well, which are very important to summon Shenron. Uh, and obviously CC, right? Now I will point out, you're not going to get all 1,000 in one day, right? That's just a ridiculous amount. But I'll be showing you all the best ways, right? So the first way, well the best way I usually work out, you know, how to get them all. I have worked out like there is co-op and all that, but the best way to do it is look in the news. And then that usually shows you the best, right? So we we'll have to have a quick look. I can't remember if it's in this part or... But I know basically co-op gives you some as well. You know, if you do your daily co-op stuff. Probably PvP it does as well. Um, just trying to quickly find it. So there's the exchange shop. Uh, special missions. Uh, the title looks pretty cool as well. I really like that title. Uh, so it doesn't look like it shows you. Um, it could be, this might show us here actually. Because obviously we've got the exchange shop as well, which you can get the new background for Super Vegeta and Super Saiyan Gogeta. So it's just, um, uh, what do you call it? It's just the, the title screen, right? But it's going to be as a, the game background. So here you go, how to get them, right? So obviously this lasts up until the 7th, like, like this, well the 17th of the 7th month. That's a long time. So, obviously, you get some from Login, which we all expected. Uh, some for the new special event, which I'll show in a minute. I'll show all these events that soon, anyway. Uh, choose the Z-Power you want. So, I think this is like a special mission as well, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Non-stop anniversary raid. I'll have a YouTube short up for that soon. Best teams for that. Uh, choice battle as well. So, that's just your, your daily, uh, uh, like, little daily event that we usually get. Uh, PvP, like I said. <clears throat> so I'm assuming that's just your your daily missions, right? Uh, world anniversary missions. I'm not sure if they're up yet. We'll have a quick look and then adventure as well. But for the adventure, it just means the missions, right? Not get you you don't get it from adventures. Yeah, just the missions. So it looks like the only ways to get it. So I guess we can start having a quick look right through the events. But just just a quick reminder: these will probably change. So we'll probably get new events soon. With new ways to get these medals. So this event here is pretty easy anyway. I think you just get one from clearing it. Uh, there you go, five for first time clear. So fairly easy. So you can't technically just farm these up. I mean, you can farm the equipments up, which these equipments are good. But you can't farm the medals up. Um, what else is there? So, oh, and by the way, you do get 500 cc for that. So I do recommend that. I don't know if you get any from this bingo here. We'll have a quick look. Yet again, I'll have a video up for this bingo soon. I'll probably make a little YouTube short because it's not very difficult. Um, okay, maybe not. I mean, it didn't say there was any anyway, but... I just want to make sure because sometimes Legends does leave out some info on some of this stuff. So, no, it doesn't look like it. Um, yet again, like I said, Raid. Now, Raid, you can farm this. You can farm the medals from. Uh, let's have a quick look. So, yeah, limited time rewards, you obviously get two per day, well, no, uh, six per day, because you get three limited rewards per day. But, as you can see there, in the normal rewards, you can just manually farm them up. Obviously, you do get more raid medals doing it that way as well, which is better. So, it's, it's actually a pretty good event to grind out, because you're getting raid medals, and you're also getting the anniversary medals, right? So, if you do want to grind it out, I probably heavily recommend doing that. PvP, you could do as well. But I would say anniversary, like the raid will be better. Like I said, because mainly you get more rewards. Obviously, with PvP you'll get rewards at the end. But you know, you're going to get Z-Power from this. You're going to get slot movers, which obviously Bonanza's on. So to me, raid would be a lot better to do. But yeah, yeah it's up to you. PvP would probably be a good choice anyway. Um, I can't remember if you get any from this. This challenge battle. Um, no, see, so you do get these medals though, which are good. Yet again, I'll have a video up for how to be that up soon as well. I just sort of get this one out of the way first, just to sort of make it a bit easier. Sort of, I guess, like a step process, I guess you want to call it. 
Um, the rest I wouldn't expect. Uh, the new free to play event, which we will get this upcoming like re um, weekly reset, we will probably get uh, the medals for there. But yet again, at, at the moment of this recording, uh, that isn't up. Uh, choice battle, I've already done one today, but you can do like salt mover one, energy, all that. Same thing, you'll still get it. Uh, there won't be any here or in the upgrade section, nothing there. Nothing in the special one either. Co-op there will be, but when we get the new co-op, which is in three days, right? So basically reset. Uh, PvP should be up now when I'm recording this video. Hopefully. Yeah, it is, okay. Let's quickly spam through that. Um, so see how much you get. I'm assuming it will tell. Maybe not. Uh... I don't know why all this is popping up. They should give, I'm, I'm assuming it'll be two or three per day. If I'm not mistaken, but I don't think it's going to show me unless I go in. But yet again, you can get some for PvP, right? Uh, missions as well, you should be able to get some as well. Yet again, like I said, these will be updated throughout the anniversary. So, as you can see here, this is the one that we're talking about. Uh, these, I'm assuming will update daily. These missions here. Obviously, yeah, I would assume they would. Uh, I mean, I could be... Does it have a timer there? Um, okay, maybe not. I'm not too sure about that. But that's where you get... How you get them. And then that ticket there, you can exchange for Z-Power for a character. So, that's probably worth doing if it is daily. But I'm not too sure if it is or not. Uh, let's have a look in the raids. Uh, doesn't look like anything there. Nothing there as well. So I think they're the only way. Oh, and obviously adventure as well. Make sure you get your adventures done. Obviously get CC as well. Which it looks like. Have they increased a little bit? Was that? Total 150? Might be. Yes. Yeah, so they've increased that. But as you can see there. 11,000 you get two. 40,000 you get another two medals. So. They sort of slowly trinkle. I don't know if trinkle is the right word. But they slowly release these medals out. It's just working out the best way to sort of find them and pick them up, if that makes sense. But I think that's about it. We'll double check. Actually, we'll look at the exchange up because I think that is it. Like I said, raid's going to be your best option. But let's have a look, right? So, what's this here? Okay, so you get your card sleeves there for 30, which it is a lot. 30 medals, right? I probably would recommend saving up for your multi Z power first for your LF. Because obviously you can use, it, use this for the new Gogeta or Vegito. So that's going to be helpful. But yet again, I would recommend picking these up. Because they do look pretty cool, right? The artwork's incredible. Uh, what else in the exchange shop? Probably just random stuff. If you haven't got all this sort of stuff, you can just pick them up. These are all the ones already got. But just, yeah, just to pick up, just in case you missed it. They usually have, uh, yeah, messages as well in case you missed them. The customizer, I'm pretty sure, has like Charlotte stuff as well, like um, the costumes that for Charlotte. But since I've already got them all, that's why it's not showing up for me. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's where it is. Well, that's what they said it should be in the reveals and stuff. Oh, actually, I have I did miss a few. Sorry, I'll be able to pick them up. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be it for today's video, guys. Uh, like I said, this mission, or oh, these, this event is obviously really good because all the missions you get in CC is definitely worth it. But, um, yeah, if you guys need help with, like, you know, answering of these, like, missions and that, just uh, let me know in the comment section below. And, uh, yeah, if you guys like this video and you want to see more, please like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys all in the next one.